This is Captain Drake, and today I will be taking you through six tiger shark encounters. Let's begin. Number six. Maybe the divers were wrong. Maybe the diver's guide should have been more careful. No one really knows. We know this is one shark encounter that these divers won't forget anytime soon. And things might have turned out worse if not for how quick one of the guides was. This is a part of the Fiji water, and the aquatic life is something worth noting. Of course, the divers take a break to admire the free flow of fish and other sea animals without clashing amongst themselves. Little did they know that they would have a closer encounter with one of the biggest sea creatures they would meet in the water. The tiger shark spots the crew and decides to pay them a greeting. At first, it goes for one of the diving guides, and this guide is able to ward off the tiger shark. But it is not done. The shark redirects its direction and heads for the divers who are simply enjoying the look of the ocean from inside the ocean. Luckily, a second guide predicts the shark and quickly pushes off the shark from the intended direction. No one was hurt, but someone could have easily lost a head in that attack. Number 5. Instead of a shark encounter, what if it is a human encounter? In this video, you would see that the shark was probably more scared by this encounter than the human diver. It is pretty dense in the water at first. The fishes are having a field day moving from one place to another, just enjoying being a fish. Then this diver decides it could be a good day to take a few snapshots of sea life. And boy, he was far from wrong. The photographer diver gets to work and then sees the tiger shark from a distance. He goes to the water's surface for a bit to get some air, but he collides with the shark when he submerges in the water. <laughs> At this point, the shark and the diver are alarmed. The shark quickly understands that the source of the collision doesn't count as a threat and continues on its journey, but not before having a quick snuggle with the photographer. Number four, what if you bring the shark to you? After eight good months of waiting and baiting this great shark, this duo shark enthusiast finally meets a huge tiger shark. By huge, I mean about 12 feet long shark. While on the water, the bait is thrown then the male enthusiast retreats into the shallow waters waiting for action on the fishing line. Finally, they get a reaction, and he is optimistic about it being a tiger shark. Legends, here we have one extremely large, healthy tiger shark. Beautiful big girl. And uh, yeah, so that is about 12 feet of tiger. He reels in the shark as the female gets the hook remover to release the shark from the wincing pain of the hook. Very healthy. No chunks or nicks or anything yet. Oh, there she goes. Big kick. You're just gonna have to guide her over this sandbar tail, so yeah. just keep pushing. Once disarmed, the shark is as patient and gentle as ever. It allows the duo to touch and admire its nature. Eventually, they are done with gaining whatever experience they want. You can see how thrilled the female companion is as she holds and finally guides the shark back into the comfort of its habitat. Number three. At first, it seemed like the usual brief shark encounter that would be over soon. But to the surprise of this diver, this silent battle lasted way longer than he would have thought. This tiger shark is a bit gentle in the starting minutes of the battle. It is quick to recoil once the fishing spear comes in contact with its skin. 
but it gets to a time when it decides to damn fear and goes head on for the diver. The diver moves back to his kayak and grabs bait to lure the tiger shark away from his trail. But the shark is wiser. The battle continued for a long time until the shark gave up and went on its way, not before wincing and recoiling in shock and pain from the sharp fishing spear's head. Number two, this was a rescue mission. The animal in danger was a medium-sized sea turtle, while the attacker was a giant tiger shark. As the shark bites the sea turtle, the turtle begins to wiggle its way out of the shark's grasp. It eventually holds on to the boat's rim and goes from the mouth of the shark. But the shark is not done. Hold on. How do we get, get the turtle? Get the turtle. We, we gotta rescue the turtle. We gotta rescue the turtle. As the turtle begins to flap its tiny body and escape, the shark follows in hot pursuit. But it is quickly stopped by the moving boat. The Samaritan rescue guards see how hard the turtle is trying to escape its predator and saves it from the water. Get him out of here, this big damn shark. All right, we got him. See that tiger shark? They get the turtle on board the boat without much hassle and relocate the turtle to a different location in the water. Hopefully, somewhere the shark won't reach. Number one. This diver is trying to have a good day fishing alone, and he has got two fish on lock when he gets company. As he wraps up his catch, he realizes a tiger shark has joined him. He whips out his fishing spear to defend himself and his catch against an attack. The shark begins to circle him slowly, baiting. He goes to the water's surface for a bit, and as he submerges, the shark pretends to have disappeared from the sea. It resurfaces a few seconds later, coming for the same thing as before, his piece of the diver's catch. Oi! Captain Drake posts videos like this weekly. Show support to the captain by subscribing to this channel and liking this video.